officially Pear Blossom Weekend and all the fun and festivities start today. And here to explain it all is the Heart of Medford Association Executive Director, Diane Bentley Raymond. Diane, good to see you again. Good to see you too. So tell us, when does this all kick off? Today's the day. This, we are all things Pear Blossom officially. 3 p.m. is the start of the street fair. Okay. And our opening ceremonies are tonight at 5.30 p.m. Oh, in just a few minutes. Very yeah, good. Yeah, very close. Yeah. Um, you know, we're, we're more excited than ever this year. Pear Blossom is an iconic event for this community, and it's always special. But this year, there's a couple of things that coincide that make it just a little bit more special. One is that it's the 60th anniversary of Pear Blossom. Wow. And uh, it is also, we have a new home, the Commons Park Block. So this is the first official event that will take place in the park block, and that's a historic moment. And it's a beautiful area. Oh, it's not only is, is it gorgeous, but we've got the weather to go with it today, so we're, <laughs> we're keeping our fingers crossed. And, uh, you know, the other thing is that this is the first official event the Heart of Medford has been involved in since we launched the new brand, Metro Medford. And our banners are up. People see it driving around the business district. The new Metro Medford banners are up. So all of those things are kind of falling into place all at the same time for this event. And we're also kicking off the uh, the city is partnering with Pacific Power and a Blue Sky Challenge for the community. Um, so a lot of things that just come together really nicely for this event. Mm -hmm. And you know we have a very large viewing area so a lot of our viewers may not have been to the Pear Blossom Festival or Fair or Parade or et cetera, et cetera, the run even. Uh, so why, why should people come now? What are they missing if they've never been here? Well you know anybody that uh, wants to know anything about the Rogue Valley, this is a great event to come to. It is really a celebration of all that we have to offer in the Rogue Valley from the wonderful food that is produced here to the wine to the beer it's a celebration of all of that um, so there's a run there's the parade which is you know goes back to 1954 started out with 50 uh, carts people pulling carts behind them oh, and man. you know this parade this year we have over 150 I know we're uh, excited entries. to be part of it as well we'll be there 4,000 participants so it has really grown and uh, so there's the run, there's the parade, there's the smudge pot stroll, which features 17 of our finest dining establishments. Oh. People purchase a class, glass, they are sold out by the way, okay, and they you. go from, from uh, restaurant to restaurant and sample yeah. their, their pairings of, of wine and, and pear. Sounds nice. And then there's the pear fair tent. Uh, folks can purchase a ticket for $15 and get 10 tastings of different food and wine and beer. Oh, very nice. So just a lot it's, of really fun things to do. And again, yeah. that gives you a flavor of who are we in the Rogue Valley? What are we all about? And yeah. this celebrates that. And it's very, very fun for everybody as well. All right. Something so for everybody. Exactly. We're going to take a quick break. We'll have much more in a moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to our Five on Five. We're talking about all the Pear Blossom festivities this weekend with Diane Bentley Raymond. So tell us about the timeline for all these events tomorrow. Okay, well the run starts, uh, the first run starts at seven tomorrow morning. The uh, 10 mile run is at 8.20. The parade kicks off at 11 o'clock. And uh, the street fair is open tomorrow from seven until 5 p.m. So boom, 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 we've, we've got events all day long. And the street fair this year has over uh, just about 100 vendors. Everything you can imagine from elephant ears, which is one of my personal mm -hmm. favorites, uh, <laughs> to some great food, um, all kinds of things to purchase, face painting, things yeah. for the kids. We have a whole kid zone with a bounce house, and uh, there's something for everybody. Absolutely. Okay, and it all just kicks off in just a couple minutes, right? A couple of minutes. 5.30 is opening ceremonies. Uh, Mayor Wheeler will be there. We'll be reading a pro proclamation to kick off the Blue Sky Challenge, and uh, some welcoming remarks, and uh, we'll be officially on our way. Is, now where is that exactly? That is at the Commons stage, okay. right, of course, which yeah. is in the park block, and it's the, uh, the north end of the park block, so right there on 5th and Bartlett. Very good, Diane. Great to see you again. Great to Thanks see so you. Thanks so much for coming. You bet. Stay with us. We'll be right back. 